And later on, brothers and sisters, inshallah, you will become very strong and you will be able to figure out. And it comes in the Quran, brother. It comes in the Quran. Huh? And you will be able to figure out, inshallah. Now, number four. Li Ainani. What is it? Li Ainani. What is the meaning of it? I have two eyes. Okay? So, what is Li? Jahar Maju, Shubhu Jumla, Khabar. Where is Muptada? Ainani. Is it Marfu? Why? Alif is there. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Okay, brother, then comes Wow. Ataf. What is Uznani? Mautufun Allah Ainani. Then again Wow came. What is Yadani? Mautufun Allah Ainani. It will go to the first. And Rijlani, Mautufun Allah Ainani. We cannot say they are all Muptadas. There is only one Muptada, which is Ainani. And the rats are all connected to the Ainani by way of Ataf. Connect, a conjunction. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Fi hazal hayji. What is the meaning of hayji? Neighborhood. Hayji, neighborhood. Suburb. Neighborhood, we can say. You know, like you, you have Oakville, and then you, uh, uh, you have. Uh, Oakville is not a city. It is. A, I, I think I will call Oakville neighborhood or. Woodbridge, huh? okay, so uh, East York, you know, these are small, small things, you know. Uh, Richmond Hill, huh? suburb you can say, suburb. Hayyi means suburb you can say. Okay. Fi hazal hayyi madrasatani. What is it? Madrasatani. Okay. How will you translate? In this neighborhood, there are two schools. That's all. In this neighborhood, there are two schools. What is fi? Haza. And what is al-hayi? Badal. Huh? It is badal. Say, where is our mubtada? Badrasatan. Uh, badal. So many examples with badals are coming. Huh? You, you, you are getting extra practice now. Okay, fine. Salatul Fajri Raka Atani Raka Atani Salatul Fajri How many words are there? Salatul Fajri What kind of a compound is this? Mudaf Mudafili So what is Salatu? Mubtada Wahua Mudaf And Fajri is Mudafili And where is our Khabar? Raka Atani Got the idea? Is Raka Atani one word? Yes. Is it marfu? Yes. yes, it is marfu. Very good. Lil baiti. Yes, brother Faru. Uh, Faruk, your question is what is the khabar in number five? Khabar in number five is fi haza. Are you with me? Fi haza is jar majrur shibu jumla khabar. And then al hayi is your badal. Huh? And Madrasatani is your Muftada. Got the idea? Inshallah. Number seven, Lil Baiti. These are very simple sentences, brother. But only they are in dual form. The Muftada is in dual form. Lil Baiti, what is Lil Baiti? Jar Maju For the house. What is for the house? There are two keys. Miftahani. Mif, Miftahani, Miftahani. Lil Baiti, Miftahani. So Miftahani is your Muftana. Huh? And Lil Baiti is your Khabar, Jar Majru, Shibu Jumla Khabar. Liman Hata Nil Bakaratani, Liman Hata Nil Bakaratani. What is your answer? Huma lil fallahi. Huma lil fallahi. So brother, Huma is your Mubtada and lil fallahi is your Jar Majur Shubu Jumla Khabar. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Number nine. 
Tabibani min in Kaltarra. Are they from UK? La Huma min Faransa. Huma min Faransa. What is Huma? Muktada. Where is our Khabar? Min Faransa. What is Min Faransa? Jar Majru. Shugu Jumla Khabar. MashaAllah. Alhamdulillah. Fi Kariati Masjidani Sahih. Now you see here, fi kariyati. How many words? Three. Fi half chair. Kariyati is a majroor. Wa huwa mudaf. And ya mutakallim, mudaf ilayhi. Fi kariyati, jar majroor, shibu jumla khabar, mukaddam. And what is masjidani? Mubtada. Huh? Is it marfu? Yes. What is the sign of its marfu? Alif. And what is sagirani? Not, mashallah, mashallah. Beautiful. Huh? Beautiful. Now, brothers and sisters, we come to number three. Once you understand the basic, it's all easy. The only thing is now you will go home and write it. Huh? Inshallah. <clears throat> Read the following example and then put in the empty spaces. <clears throat> Tamiz, eh? okay, li kam, wad bit, wad bit, akhirahu, the last of it, akhirahu, fine brother. The example are, see, kam ukhtan laka, kam kalaman indaka, do you see ukhtan laka, kalaman indaka. So with, uh, with your relatives, you will use Laka. And with things possessed that you possess in Daka. And then comes Hayaratan fil Jamiyati. And the noun underlined is Mansub. And what is it? Tamiz. Huh? Got the idea? It is Tamiz. Okay. Sister Salma. Now. Akam Kalaman in Daka. You will form the sentence by using. Kam kalaman in dakas. All that you are using is tamiz. Huh? Okay. Laka has come. What will you use? Kam uchtan achan ibnan bintan. Are you with me? Kam, how will you say? Uchtan laka. Fine, brother. Abir, fi hazi shari. What do you see, what do you see in the street? Sayaratan. Sayaratan. Or you can say kam fundukan. How many hotels? Kam fundukan or kam sayaratan. Huh? But we cannot count sayaratan. There are too many. Kam fundukan. Huh? Or if you are passing by York Mills and Leslie, you can say, Kam Baitan Kabiran. <laughs> How many big houses are in this street? Okay. Now, Fi Kariyati Ka in your village. Sister Sukhaina, what will you say? Kam Masjidan Fi Kariyati Ka. Got the idea? Inshallah. Now, Sister. Naima, fi faslikum. What will you say in the class? What is in your class? Taliban. So what will you say? Kam Taliban. How many? Or you can say, Kam Saburatan. How many blackboards in your class? Okay, fine. This is very nice, Sister Fatima. Fis sanati, what do you have in sana? Shahar. So what will you say? Kam shaharan. What will you say? Are you with me? What is the meaning of shaharan? Months. What, you, what do you say? Write down. Kam shaharan. Huh? Sisters? 
Is it all clear, Sister Maimuna? Sister Abir? Inshallah, Hafsa? Sister Sumaya? Does it make sense now? Huh? Okay. You got to work hard, huh, sister? Inshallah. Fine. What is the. You can say two months. Huh? G? You can say two months. No, no, answer will be different. We are, we are only practicing how to ask a question. Huh? In this particular case, your answer can be any, anything. Huh? Fine. Okay. Sister uh, Sumaya, is it your turn? Darrajatan is a bicycle. So what will you say? Kam wheels. Kam ajalatan. What is it? Kam ajalatan. Okay, brothers and sisters. Kam ajalatan. Huh? Ajalatan. Ajalatan. One second, please. Ajalatan. Okay? Kam Ajalatan. Liddaraj. How many bi uh, wheels to the bicycle? Can you use, uh, this question and answer, can you use the means as in uh, Ajalatan? Not in asking question. After Kam, see there is a good question. Huh? If there is a confusion, it should be removed. When you are asking question with come, the tamiz has to be singular now. It can never be plural or dual. Are you with me? After come, the tamiz that we are using has to be singular. Huh? So you will say, for example, come baitan, come kalaman, come kitaban, come dularan. Kam sayaratan, huh? and kam ajalatan, kam shahran, kam, kam ibnan, kam bintan, kam uhtan, kam akhan, kam sadikan. Huh? Always singular. Huh? Fine. Uh, sister uh, uh, Arifa, fi gurfatika. What will you say? What did she say? Kam sariran, that's good. How many beds in the room? Huh? Very good. Kam sariran fi gurfatika. Huh? Or you can even say, kam kursiyan. Or you can say, kam nafizatan. But kam sariran is a very beautiful question. Oh, you got to. Brother? Another, yes, sister. No, that is the way we, we say how many and then whatever we are saying how many is in how many pens. In English what will you say? Pen, but in, in Arabic, it, it, when you translate it will be pens. But we will say come and then singular now. Baitan. Tamis. Mansub. Got the idea? That we have to just understand it. After come. Singular noun will come. Huh? Singular noun will come. Okay? Inshallah. Huh? Okay. And by doing all this, you will inshallah make yourself strong. Remember, no plurals, no duals, only singular. Okay? Again I say, kam kalaman, kam kitaban, kam masjidan, kam mudarisan, kam taliban, kam talibatan, kam sayaratan. Okay? Kam kursiyan, kam sariran, kam nafizatan, kam baban. How many doors to the house? Kam baban lil baiti. Okay? How many doors are in the house? Like that, you know. We are using singular, but if translation in English will be plural. Huh? Okay? Now another thing. See, let me tell you something. As switch. As soon as you ask a question with come, the tamiz has to be used. It will be singular. But when you translate, you can translate the way we translate in English. How many pens do you have? Yeah. Huh? But tamiz will be singular now. Nothing else. Huh? Inshallah. Okay, brother. Change the muftada 
into dual. Example is given, Hadha Kitabun. What will be the Hadhani Kitabani? So who's next now? Sister Maimuna? Hadha Kalamun? What will you say, sister? Hadhani Kalamani. Huh? Fine. This is very easy. Here you have been given one example. Hadhi Mistaratun Hatani Mistara Tani. What will you say? Hatani? Sister Nasir, Hatani Mistara Tani. Huh? Mistara Tani. Dual. Huh? Okay. Sister Nusrat, uh, Hadha Talibun. Hadhani Talibani. But the Farooq, Hadhi Talibatun. Hadhi will change into Hatani Talibatani. Hatani Talibatani. Are you with me? You cannot say Hatani Talibani. It has to be Hatani Talibatani. Okay? Hatani Tali Ba Hatani Taliba Tani. Got the idea? Hatani Taliba Tani. Okay, Brother Farooq, what is Hatani? Okay, what will you call Hatani? Muftada. And where is the Khabar? Talibatani. These are two female students. Huh? Okay. Fine. Brother Hassan. Hadar Rajulu Mudarisun. Now this is a very beautiful sentence, brother. Mashallah, Mudarisani. Mashallah. See? Hadha Nirrajulani. Haza nirrajulani mudarrisani. Maybe I should write it, huh? Okay, I will write down in red. Okay, brother? Haza nirrajulani mudarrisani. Are you with me, brother and sisters? Look at it properly. Hadha nirrajulani mudarrisani. Sister Abir, I want you to analyze it. Yes. 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 It is khabar. See, if you say not, then where is the khabar then? Huh? If you say it is not, and it, it, in order to be not, it has to be al mudarisan. So it is not al mudarisan. So hazani is your muftada, a rajulani is your badal, and mudarisani is your khaman. Huh? Brother Salman, you got it? Brother Muhammad? Yes. Huh? Everybody? Sister Maimuna? Inshallah? You got it, Sumayya? Hafsa? Sister Salma? Inshallah. Okay. Now, uh, Brother Abdus Samad. Hazani Talibani Min Al Hindi. Okay. Hazani Talibani Min Al Hindi. So, what is Hazani? Muftada. And what is Talibani? Badal. And where is the Khabar? Jar Majul. Shibu Jumla Khabar. Mashallah. Excellent. Brother Salman. What did you say, brother? No, it is Hazihi. So what will you make Hazi into? Hatani. Not Hatani Satani Minal Yabani. So if you say Hatani Satani, what is Hatani? Uptada. What is the Satani? Badal. And where is the news? Minal Yabani, Jar Majur, Shibu Jumla Khabar. Brother Muhammad, number eight. Hadihi Hatani Hatani Sayaratani Sayaratani 
No, but you want Lil Mudi? <laughs> no, <laughs> big... <laughs> if you say Lil Mudi Rani, it will be wrong. You know why? You can say. You can use Lil Li, but then Mudi Rani will change into Mudi Raini. And will you say? Then it will change into Mudi Raini. But Dr. Saif has not introduced Majroor form. So we are only using marfu form of the dual. Are you with me? Let us use majroor form now that Brother Muhammad has used it. You will say, Ha ta nissayaratani lil mudiraini. Mudirani, mudiraini, mudiraini. Are you with me? So what? Because hafjar came. So the hafjar is a majroor. So mudirani has to change into mudiraini. But we are not doing that. We are giving two cards to the Mudi because he deserves it. Huh? Okay. Hatani, <laughs> Sayaratani, Lil Mudi. So Hatani, Murtada, Sayaratani is your Badal and then Jar Majur, Shibu Jumla, Khabar. MashaAllah. Okay, Sister Salma, you have. Mashallah. Liman hazanil miftahani. Miftahani. Liman hazanil miftahani.